I was coaching debate in a high school in the Detroit area. And um, a lot of the people that came out to judge these high school debates were in communication departments in that part of Michigan. And of course, that happened all over the country. And um, so they would talk about central states. So I just went, even as a high school teacher. And then when I went to graduate school then at Michigan, then I just went every year from that point on. So I started going to Central, certainly by, uh, probably 68 or 69. Wow. And how has it impacted your professional life? How has it become part of your professional identity and who you are? Well, I, the association was just always important to me. I'm not certain why, but when I was a graduate student, and even as an undergraduate, a lot of my mentors, a lot of the faculty had been involved in Central States. I mean, I, Ken Anderson was, was obviously, Bruce Grombeck was obviously, um, and I knew them well, and I don't know, I just started going to Central, and then actually got interested in, in running for administrative posts, and so I did. Then I happened to be, I was lucky, I was the uh, planner for the 50th anniversary convention. Uh, we did have a big birthday cake. There was this big joke, and I can't remember now if it was the joke or the truth, that some man jumped out of the cake. I think that's what we did. And, we, and it was the first convention where there were spotlight programs. And, and at that point in Central, major scholars were still going. It's not like now. And um, so I had all these spotlight programs. I can't remember how many of them, but quite a few. Not so different from what I did many years later at NCA. Right. And when were you president of NCA? 97. That's right. Um, but so we had these special programs that were wonderful. I mean, I can remember one program that um, Lloyd Bitzer and am I blocking? Might have been Gerald Miller. Oh, wow. They traded sides. That is that Lloyd Bitzer argued for quantitative studies. And yeah. That would have been great to oh, see. Oh, McCroskey yeah, was on programs. Jane Blink. Every, everybody. Right. Because people were still, uh, scholars, people that you'd heard of were still going to Central. I mean, that's where the, obviously the big PhD programs were. And those people came. How would you describe the personality of Central? Oh, I think uh, uh, friendly, um, entertaining, warm. Um, maybe I wouldn't use scholarly. I mean, that varies from year to year. But normally there are as many good programs as you have time to go to anyway. Right. And I really like it as an opportunity for our graduate students to, mm -hmm. you know, be around, be, yeah. that's what I think is.